Hello, I'm Rosalie de la Forêt. Today I'm going to demonstrate how you can make your own herbal facial scrub. Facial scrubs are used to both clean and exfoliate the skin. They usually involve some gentle buffing materials to slough away dead skin cells. The result is soft and radiant skin. There are lots of different recipes for facial scrubs out there. So today I'll be showing you how to make an herbal facial scrub using rose hips and lavender flowers. Let's take a look at our ingredients. To make this facial scrub, you'll need the following. One tablespoon organic old fashioned rolled oats, one tablespoon organic raw almonds, two teaspoon dried organic rose hip powder, one teaspoon organic lavender flower powder, and one teaspoon French green clay. Here we have organic old fashioned rolled oats. These add a gentle exfoliating action to this mix. They're also somewhat emollient, helping to soothe and moisturize the skin. Here we have ground almonds. If you can only find whole almonds at your store, you can easily grind the almonds in a food processor or a clean coffee grinder. These ground almonds add another element of exfoliation. Next, we have the rose hip powder. Rose hips are astringent, helping to tighten and tone the skin. Here we have lavender flower powder. Lavender flowers are antimicrobial, helping to clean the skin. And lastly, we have French green clay. Clay is wonderful for the skin. According to Mountain Rose Herbs, it literally drinks oils, toxic substances, and impurities from the skin. Its toning action stimulates the skin by bringing fresh blood to damaged skin scales, revitalizing the complexion, and tightening pores. Okay, so here I have all of our ingredients all measured out. All we have to do now is simply stir this up really well and mix all the ingredients together thoroughly. And this now is our dry powder mix. This can be stored indefinitely, so you could even make this up in larger batches if desired. And this is kind of the first step to making the herbal facial scrub. All right, I think that's mixed up pretty well. So to get this ready for our skin, basically what we're gonna do is mix about two to three teaspoons, you can just eyeball it, of the powder. And then you're gonna mix that with some kind of liquid. I'm just gonna use water here, but you could use milk, you could use tea, honey, um, all sorts of things, hydrosol even. And basically you're just gonna mix enough water and dry powder together until it forms a paste. And here we have our herbal facial scrub. Once it's ready, you can just take the scrub and you can uh, rub it onto your face and neck just using little circular patterns here. And you'll feel it has kind of a little gritty substance to it, that exfoliating action. And then if you'd like, you could leave that on for three to five minutes or you could just rinse it off immediately with cold water. And for storing this, there's a couple different options. If you're gonna use it at the sink, you can use a, a jar like this and just take a little spoon and dispense the powder that way into your hand to make a little uh, the paste. Or if you're gonna use it in the shower, I like putting it in a spice jar like this and then you can just shake the powder out and that way you don't contaminate the rest of the powder with water. So there you have it. You have all the steps to making and using your own facial scrub. Remember, there are limitless possibilities for ingredients. You can use different herbs, different clays, and a huge variety of different liquids. I hope this video will be the beginning of your own facial scrub experiment.